Hello, my name is Izwan. I'm the Chief Operating Officer of Petronas ICT. I've caught into this position in a fairly young age. I was 35 when, when I, was, I was appointed to this position five years ago. You can't learn all these things in school. So my main People ask me sometimes, what's the secret sauce is one? What's the secret sauce of, of, of your career? I would say it's learning from people. You, you, you don't stop learning once you finish your high school or once you finish your university. The main learning is from people. When I came 18 years ago, um, I had so many leaders who were successful back then. I came in as a junior executive and I've been blessed with many of those uh, leaders actually took me under their wing coach me, train me, and, and, and share the experience with, with me. But I believe half of the story as well is about we searching for our own mentor. The realisation that you, you, will, you need to continue learning, you have to learn, continue to learn, but also you're not the smartest. You, there will always be someone smarter than us, and that's powerful. If you're a student, for example, taking your SPM today or going back to the, to, going to the university, I would encourage, find a mentor. You know, learning takes time and sometimes you have to experience it yourself and that takes time. But that's why I come back to mentorship, how I've been blessed with many mentors across many industries. I believe the formal mentoring framework is important because uh, running an organisation, doesn't matter it's a 10-man organisation, 100-man or 1,000-man or 100,000-man organisation needs some kind of system. The system must be able to cater and, and nurture this. If you have a good people, but the system does not nurture these people, it's not good as well. The key point is to be able to draw down the experience, build a long-term relationship, share your successes, share your failures. Over time, I built a lot of relationship with my seniors, uh, with my peers, and with my juniors as well. You'll be surprised. A number of people who are younger than me became my mentor as well. Because it's, you can learn from, from, from anyone and a different angle. The realisation that you need to learn, especially if you're going to university and, and you think learning is just about textbook, exam, you may be successful in the school of university, but you may not be successful in the school of life. Again, this is about absorbing. You have to be a sponge. You have to be there, go there and talk to this person. And, and over time, you'll find out that you also have a lot of things to give, not just to take. And over time, hopefully, you'll become a mentor to many of them as well. We look at someone that we admire, we like, we, we, uh, we respect, and, and approach them to be a mentor. And, and, and draw down the knowledge from them. Draw down the, 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 the philosophy, the thinking, you know, uh, seek advice from them. And, and that's, that, that's key for me. And, and that's how we grow. If you don't know something, raise your hand. And that's key. Culturally, we, whenever we, we, made, we made a mistake or we don't know, we don't want to look not smart. So culturally, sometimes we don't really want to know or ask these questions because we're not, oh, these, are, these are stupid questions, right? In the early days, raise your hand, ask questions as much as you can because that's when you really need to be a sponge and absorb. Learn as much as you can. Um, second portion of raise your hand it's really about volunteering, seizing the opportunity. Because I don't think the young ones uh, um, do that enough. Whenever we have a challenge, if you work in a company, for example, whenever have a company have a challenge or opportunity, you know, go raise your hand and say, look, I want to be involved in this. I can contribute in this. Uh, uh, and that's where you gain knowledge. Human are creature of knowledge. Human also are creature of habit. So it's about to teach to grow, you've got to, do, you've got to have all the knowledge in, you've got to absorb all the knowledge.